ArenaNet gave us an update about build templates, and the community's eyes fell upon the price, which may end up being a little steep, but that might not matter at all, because within the update post lies some far more important information. ArenaNet stated that, We've also been following a related conversation about third-party programs. Our policy on third-party programs has not changed. We don't have any desire to take punitive action against players who are abiding by the terms of service and code of conduct while using third-party programs, but we can't declare any third-party program safe to use because it would require us to commit to oversight. They then follow that up with, if you choose to use third-party programs, you're responsible for making sure you're not doing so in a way that violates the game's rules. This statement is as surprising as it is long-awaited. ArenaNet have more or less said that as long as you don't do anything which breaks the TOS with a third-party program, then you won't get banned for it. They're also covering their own ass very well, but that's besides the point and totally fair. The TOS policy that was linked reads as follows. We do not permit the use of any program that gives one player an unintended, unnatural, or unfair advantage over another player. This includes programs that alter game balance in favor of one player over another, automate actions within the game, promote unattended gameplay, or have an adverse effect on other players. So that means that under this policy, a third-party build template add-on is completely legal, as it doesn't give an advantage, change game balance, promote unattended gameplay, or have an adverse effect on any other players. If anything, third-party build templates will be a slight handicap, in exchange for less limited slots and no price tag. The handicap coming from the lack of in-game integration, hotkey support, no free inventory space, and of course, slower swapping overall. It's worth noting that there may be scope to improve how build templates work with a third-party program now, because of how powerful the in-game templates will be. There you have it! ArenaNet actually pulled off a fantastic compromise and it somewhat fell on deaf ears. Everyone who doesn't want to be limited to six build slots or pay a bunch of gems for official build templates probably doesn't have to. And the rest can be satisfied by the in-game version, so everybody's happy...ish? Now, it obviously sucks that it seems unlikely complaints regarding the in-game templates will be addressed, but I think this compromise is probably the most efficient solution while being quite a generous one in my opinion. They could have easily have left Daroya and his nine characters with purple in every hole completely out to dry. Now he's only slightly moist. As a bonus meme, the terms of service do actually leave some extra space for add-ons as well. Stuff like gear checking doesn't really break them right now, at least not in PvE anyway, provided they're not used maliciously, and I'm sure other gadgets might end up permissible, which is something that might be interesting. It's probably not the best idea to push the envelope too much, and it remains to be seen if anyone will take over development of some kind of build template add-on, or indeed how much more advanced it can become, given the in-game version being very, very powerful. Perhaps now that ArenaNet seem to have relaxed a bit, Arc DPS templates will end up getting enabled again, or at least passed on. Now, it's time for some advice. Ignore it at your peril. Do not install any third-party software that is not explicitly trusted and permitted, i.e. ArcDPS, Reshade, or Taco, or open source and reviewed by people who know what they're doing. For example, the DirectX 12 proxy. If that program has something that is against the rules, ArenaNet can and will swing the ban hammer. You have been warned. Still, I'm really glad that ArenaNet finally said something pretty clear-cut on third-party add-ons, which should hopefully soothe the raging minds of 17 build chronos. Good communication, guys. Keep it up. Thanks for watching. One subscribe equals one template slot.